Hello beautiful people, what's up? Max Savoya here and from the bottom of my heart I hope you're well and safe. In this video, 5 riffs all the beginners should know. But before we get started, I have few questions. Have you subscribed? Are you following me on social media? No? Shame on you, do it right now. Great. Now, grab your coffee and let's go for what we came for. When we are starting our journey as guitar players, it's nice to play some classic riffs, but no, I'm not talking about smoke on the water. I'm talking about some other classic riffs that can bring some challenge, can make us play a little better. But now, enough of talking. Let's play some riffs. Riff number one, Breaking All the Rules by Peter Frampton. And I picked this riff because of three simple reasons classic energetic and long and as much we play long riffs as much comfortable we are playing the guitar let's give a try Well, this is an easy riff, but there are some small elements you need to keep adding to the riff so you will sound much more energetic and the riff will sound much better. For example, at the beginning of the riff there is a slide there from A to B. Also, the vibratos. The vibratos are very important. And you, if you play the riff like Okay, the, no, the notes are correct, but there is no energy. You need to put some spicy, so it will be much tasty, like If you're just starting, you can just execute the notes, but once you get comfortable, promise, you're going to put all those small elements there, so your riff will sound absolutely better. Riff number two, Bad Love by Eric Clapton. And the reasons, the reasons are almost the same. Classic, energetic, long, but one thing else, you can use your wah pedal. Let's try. Amazing riff. Eric Clapton is an amazing, amazing, amazing blues player and riffs like that are so enjoyable and they make us so happy to play but now switching off the wah pedal one nice thing about this riff is the way all the parts start the part number one and three start a bit slower than the part two for example the part one and three you can clearly see the notes C and D like then catch up the speed here on G and A the part number two is the opposite start quicker 
and slow down in on F and G. So and this kind of dynamic also will first blow your mind but once you're playing this riff you're going to be really happy riff number three play that funky music by wild cherries this riff maybe you're going to call the easiest in this video but there are some tricky parts that make the riff sound as it should be and it's not that straightforward let's try As you could see, the riff is full of very short notes. For example, the first two notes. The first, the very first note is very short, while the second E is a bit longer. And then you have. Let's play the riff, but not looking into the duration of the notes, all right? It sounds right, but you know, it's missing that funky part. If you make the notes shorter, the, the riff will sound a bit different. Let's see. Riff number four, Detroit Rock City by Kiss. This riff is fantastic. Let's first play and then we talk about it. Wow, this riff is super cool and the nicest thing of this riff is the very small bend. I think it's not even a quarter step bend, but you feel like you are on the border of the swimming pool and you do like and you come back. Just take a look. Thank uh you. -huh. 
fantastic, really fantastic. Riff number five, Suck My Kiss by Red Hot Chili Peppers. And yes, I'm a big fan of Red Hot Chili Peppers and John Frusciante. This riff is full of grace notes. If you get the sense of the grace notes, you get the riff. It's going to be funky and you're going to get that beautiful swing. But now, let's give a try. Absolutely nice. So, if you are able to get this part of the grace notes, like all this, will give you the perfect swing to play this riff. If you pay attention to it's like you're loading your gun. Once again. If you play without the grace notes, still like it sounds. I can see a robot dancing. Where is the groove? Where is the funky? You need to put the grace notes. You need to load your gun like. Make much more sense. I wanna hear you trying. Please. Send to me any social media, any kind of messenger. Just send to me. I wanna hear you try. Now it's your turn. What are the five riffs you enjoy playing the most? Let me know down below in the comments. And if you like it, this video, smash the like button. Consider subscribing for more videos like this. And follow me on social media. But for now, it's so beautiful people. Keep yourself rocking, safe, alive, and kicking. See you!